driving me is not only to make my family proud, but to make Annette proud and make sure she's not forgotten. It's like passed down trauma. You know, you hear stories from your parents and your grandparents and friends, and you live with those. The troubles isn't just uh, a throwaway term. You know, something that didn't affect you. You're actually in the room now with people that this, this happened to, this is real life, and they're still living with that and dealing with that. Sometimes it does feel like it's a hard topic to talk about, and it shouldn't be hard. My auntie, Kathleen Feeney, was killed in 1973. I am the niece of Annette McAfrican, shot in 1971. I get the honour of playing my mummy and been able to be a vessel for her testimony. The more we're informed about war and our decisions and what we might think is just a simple action, it has detrimental consequences for everybody involved. As I say, I'm Annette's niece and I feel it and it affected my upbringing and that will continue for years and years to come. This is a generational problem. I'm not in, from that generation, but through transgenerational trauma, it will affect me for my whole life and it will affect everyone in my age group and the age group below because we carry these stories in our DNA and in our blood. To take those stories over to Westminster, to say that nothing is swiped under the rug. You know, we live with this every single day and we want these stories and these voices to be heard. So this journey, to me is about going over and being able to put faces to numbers, to statistics. I want the stories to be heard. The families are fighting, well our family's fighting for justice. These are innocent, innocent children and people need to know that. What I hope to get out of Westminster is recognition for these people and their stories. It is a privilege to be involved in sharing these stories. The first time we performed them here in the Playhouse, the production had such care around it, the projections, the music, the audience that we had, the care within the theatre, it was just really a beautiful thing. Um, and now to strip that back really to the stories is a really interesting experience and the stories themselves need no help. They have such meaning and power within them. It's, just really amazing. And one of the things that struck me and I think a lot of people really enjoy when they come is that whilst these scenes and these stories that the family share are absolutely packed with meaning and really something to behold and something to be part of, there's also so much warmth and humour within them that you really see the love that they, they have as a family and yeah it's a, it's a special piece of work and a, and a privilege to be a part of.